Tis the season of togetherness. And it actually turns out, I think you'll find this interesting, all the time that you spend with family and loved ones this Christmas, well, it can actually improve your health in every way. Fox News medical contributor Dr. Mark Siegel is here to explain. Dr. Mark, you know how much I love hanging out with you, so this is the perfect segment for you and I to have together. And I think the first thing that I think a lot of people don't realize is just the idea of having the communication really does sort of build them up. Isn't that right? Right, Kevin, and you are actually a perfect treatment today for this whole idea of kindness and interaction. You're always so polite and kind to everyone, and you know what that does? That causes the brain to release the happy hormone, the love hormone, mm -hmm. known as oxytocin. It lowers blood pressure. It treats stress. It improves generosity. It, it, it deals with it, it related to kindness. If you're feeling stress and you release this hormone, suddenly you're feeling empathy and generosity, and that's what we need during this holiday season. Now, before I came on, Carly was referencing the loneliness epidemic, and that's so true. I interviewed the Surgeon General Vivek Murthy about this, and he says that between the ages of 18 and 25, 60 percent of our young are reporting severe loneliness, 40 percent over the age of 25. But that generation really worries me, and some of it is connected to social media and being isolated. You know, you pointed out that social media can have some positive things, Kevin, but watch out for the isolation. So when you go to your Christmas dinner today, Christmas Day dinner, I think you check your iPhone on the door and you touch and you and you look people in the eyes. You know that touching itself improves this hormone, this happy hormone. Simply touching someone and that hormone goes up. Hugging a study shows increases it dramatically and your blood pressure drops, your heart rate drops, and your risk of diseases drop. Can I just add something to Dr. Siegel? I think stress is a major problem in the country right now. Even if you just don't absorb all the politics, I think there's this general mood right now. It's very it's tough out there let's be honest about it especially when you have a chance to connect with people I think it also reduces stress is that true and that is so true and that's another thing I, I love about you is that you you have political beliefs but you don't judge other people yeah. based on theirs and the political divisiveness in our country right now which is generating hatred and strife is bad for everyone's health so we need a collective sigh and a collective hug virtual or real and everybody accept each other's beliefs and opinions that's the way we used to be in the United States a country not of division but of accepting each other you are so great, my friend. You know how much I, I enjoy, enjoy working with you and I adore you personally. Uh, have a wonderful Christmas and a happy holiday to you, Dr. Mark Siegel. Thank you, my friend. I'm Steve Ducey. I'm Brian Kilmeade. And I'm Ainsley Earhart. And click here to subscribe to the Fox News YouTube page to catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis.